We have just arrived in Luxembourg. We have a crew of about seven people, eight people here with us right now. We're trying to figure out which bus we are supposed to get on to. We found it. it. Took us a few hours to get here, but we're in the Airbnb. Yeah, 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 and we're yeah. trying to figure out beds. So, Phil, you're sitting on my bed, all right? This is your bed? That's my bed. Dang. Little kitchen. It is 10 a.m. in the morning. About to head into the city, to Luxembourg City. Danny's in the back trying to figure out how to work his camera. <laughs> yeah, the downward angle. The squad. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for. I thought that I should take this moment to educate you on yeah. some Luxembourg history because some of our fellow colleagues just found out that it is actually a country. It became independent in 1867 after the Luxembourg crisis. Luxembourg crisis! <laughs> what about its economy at Pearl Up? <laughs> Well, after the Second World War, it is now one of the richest countries in the world. And it's very small. And we're in, currently in the financial district, so... Yeah, it's known for its very large financial sector. They're balling. They're, They're balling. They, they really figured it out. There's a McDonald's right across the street. This is what we came for. It's a beautiful day here in Luxembourg, really trying to enjoy the weather before it gets dark. Everyone's out and about, um, but really, if, you, if it gets dark here, safety is never really an issue. I mean, look at all these walls. It's pretty protected. Where are we right now? Um, Luxembourg. Uh, no, but <laughs> what, what's this place called? It's a museum of natural history, <laughs> art, <laughs> something. We are currently on Chemin, Chemin de la Corniche, which is <laughs> Merci beaucoup. which is the like little walkway next to the river. And so we're just gonna be walking along this side with this beautiful view. We have some very mature tourists. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Adolphe Bridge. We finally made it. We and finally I finally made it. Such a long journey of like 15 minutes. <laughs> I didn't think we would make it. We really have a have a crew, and uh, it was difficult, but we made it up the hill. And we made it. It's a beautiful city. This is one of the yeah. most important landmarks of Luxembourg. Night has fallen upon us, and it is pretty cold already. And there's just this street of lights and restaurants and bars that we're gonna go to. One, two. Just explain to me what that that is. It's made to Hawaii. Masku? It's a Masku. A Masku. 
we get to see sunrise because we're awake. It's a beautiful awake morning. So early. We pretty much hit every spot in Luxembourg. That you could. That you could have hit in 12 hours. Or just Luxembourg City. Yes. I, th- I would say don't spend more than 12 hours in Luxembourg because it's a small place. One night. One night would be good. Luxembourg City. Yeah. You could yeah. go maybe to the north. Um, but I for us, <laughs> it's a good trip. So lots of walls. We out. <laughs>